How you doing everyone? It's your old pal Jim here and we're playing more of Kona. Now when we last left off, we found out that there was a murder here at the... and other stuff that you, I'm sure you remember. So let's keep investigating here. Jumping from that height was akin to tempting death. Perhaps that man on the snowmobile had seen enough of this world already. Well, that's a heck of a... heck of a thing there. Um... Right, and there was some other stuff here too. Cash register instructions. Oh! To open the cash register, punch the price to number minimum. Press sale. Turn the crank two times. Punch the machine if it does work. Wait, open the... Punch the price. Two numbers minimum. Punch the price. Press sale and turn the crank two times. I yeah, keep that. I'm gonna... I guess the, the key might be... Oh, a secretary wouldn't be luxury in here. What? A secretary wouldn't be luxury in here. I don't know what that means. Why are you a thing? Wouldn't be a luxury in here, I think is what it means. Is that the same kind of brochure that we read inside the small place? Quebec's Klondike. Uh, Quebec's Klondike. Northern Quebec's economy is booming. The north of sh in that place areas population will soon reach 30,000 souls, among which thousands of happy families will be prospering thanks to the hard labor of their fathers, who will be contributing valiantly in expanding Quebec's national wealth, mines and hydroelectricity, hunting and fishing, the true Canadian dream, turn it into your reality now. Mm. I would, but I'm feeling a little gassy today. The mines, a sector, no, the mines, a sector in full expansion. Did you know that since 1960, Canada tripled the amount of resource royalties it collects? Did you know that the county's true source of richness is lying under your very feet at this very moment? The building of our schools and our hospitals depends on minerals. Exploiting our resources, the road to our future. Okay, in the back says, the county of Manistan and its people wishes to see you very soon. Très bonne entente. Fairly sure I read that wrong. Aha! Uh -huh. Fuse box. Turn off. Turn off. Turn on. Turn on. That didn't work. What does this say? The note explained that the garage and the store couldn't be supplied with electricity at the same time. Oh, okay. So I do need to get into that. I do need to get into the, uh, the garage. Okay, so what's the price on something? Does it matter what I... Oh, hey. Oh, first aid kit. Guess that wasn't creepy at all. Um, let's see. Okay, so do we have a price on something? Or can I just put whatever numbers on are on there? Because there's no prices anywhere. Now look at those. So, oh, I'm <laughs> sorry. I forgot you were there. I was trying to walk over him. Well, I mean, let's face it. Oh. This place is a mess. Oh, I see. Those things are just inner monologue thoughts of uh, Carl. I see. A radiator without power is as good as a wood stove without logs. Okay, all right. All right, so I guess two digits minimum. Okay, so I think... Uh, five. Five. And then what? Yeah, I knew it! The keys! Sure you don't want the money? Okay, I guess I don't want the money. Alright, the key is in there. Alright, so I need to get to the garage then. Pretty sure that the footprints that I saw on my Polaroid... Okay, well, th th that's from the wolves that were here a second ago. I'm pretty sure that the f mysterious footprints on my Polaroid were, um... Leading to the garage, I f I, I'm fairly sure. Is there anything here? No, I'm good. Let's just get in here, because if we get the power back into it, I think I'll be warm again. What? I have the key. Hold on a second. Hold on a collar picking minute. Oh, it's a post key. Okay. So I was wrong. <laughs> 
we well, can be wrong sometimes. I guess I'll check the post. Oops, keep building up my friend. Oh. The murder weapon. Really? Oh. What was that doing there, Carl wondered. <gasps> Hamilton must have been determined to keep some information secret to post this key. Oh. Shame he got unlucky. Yeah. Everything made sense now. Poor Hamilton's denunciation was interrupted, and he figured it would be best to lock everything up and send the key to his correspondent, who would receive the box later on. Clever, but not enough. No, oh, That's what happens to ordinary people playing spy. Yeah, I would assume so. Letter from Hamilton. It is as a citizen of Her Majesty and the free economic chambers of the world that I must address what follows to the proper authorities. The worst is happening at this very moment. It was so cold. Already Carl did not feel his toes anymore. I know, I know. I'll get to a fire in a second. The worst is happening at this very moment. I cannot write at length, but I am required, I'm requesting immediate help from my country. I believe the free world is in grave danger. A member of my community, the Honorable, and of course it gets dead. I need to find wood. I'm freezing my butt off over here. Uh, oh, log, log, log. Log, log, you'll save me. Uh, for sure. Log, log. Better than bad, it's good. Come on, come on, come on, I should have enough. Ah, oh, okay, good. I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay, so apparently, uh, world conditions still affect you even if you're reading a letter. Duly noted. Can I get in through the window? I can't. There's something in there, though. Okay, see, look at that. With that in view, I can see. Do I, can I throw them away? I thought that was in. Come on. Oh! Draft letter. Let it be known you're nothing more- Hate was in the air. Seems like some villagers barely tolerated each other. Yeesh. Let it be known you're nothing more than a brigand, a robber, a garbage hoarder, a viper, a leech, a monster. You're holding a knife to my at my throat. Too bad for me, but... Oh, dear. I was hoping the key was in there, but a little exposition's good, too. The general store still holds its secrets. Well, I don't know what the secrets are. I am... I'm beside myself as to what these secrets could be. Alright, that's it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot the lock. I'm gonna shoot the lock. I don't know if this is gonna be any good. I'm wasting a bullet, possibly, but I don't know what else to do. I don't know what the key could be. I haven't a clue. I haven't a clue. So I'm gonna shoot the lock and hope for the best. I can't even aim right. Come on, man. Oh, hold still. I wasted a bullet. <laughs> I wasted a bullet. Ah, oh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I can break the lock, but I don't know what good that's gonna- Wait, I can still do that. I don't know what good that's gonna do me, but, uh... Hooray! Now I don't have to walk around the shed. Oh, hey. Can I do something with the generator? Oh, fixed Carl generator! was no electrician, but he could identify a wiring problem when he saw one. Okay, okay, okay. Put the gun away. Maybe I don't have to shoot that thing yet. Oh, jeez. Well, every time I come in, I keep spooking myself because it's all uh, dark. Well, th these are the things, right? Oh, come on. They've got to be in the store. They've got to be. Okay, no, I was just making sure there's nothing hidden. Oh, wait a minute. Don't tell me. I missed something? Oh, for Pete's sake, the garage key. Oh, and more stuff. According to that log, 
It seemed like the whole village owed some money to the general store. Carl was far more interested in the bunch of nearby addresses he had just gotten his hands on, though. Holy cow. Note to self, this thing is, this environment is super duper interactive. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. More match. Oh my god. I have to really look into this stuff here. I wonder what all that is, though. Okay, so I'm pretty sure the other thing... I have the duct tape, so I, the other thing that I need is the... Um, it's going to be in the garage, which I now have a key for. Thank God. I was... Oh, man. I knew I was missing something. I just didn't know what it was. Oh, boy. Hello? I hear a noise. Oh, that's the fire outside. I got spooked. Okay, alright. So, uh, let's take a look here. Nothing in there. Oh, uh -huh. hardware. Uh, oh, there it is. That's the other thing. Okay. Can't believe the 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 prospect of uh, the cleanest spot in the area. Can't believe that the uh, concept of dr opening drawers was so foreign to me. I didn't look to see. Cannot believe that. I think that's enough, really. Oh wait, what's this? Staring intently at the controls won't be enough to make that lift budge. The poor thing was out of power. Oh. The crowbar was stuck under the lift. I'm gonna need that Notwithstanding crowbar. Notwithstanding Carl's imposing stature, car lifting wasn't part of his skill set yet. Yet. I'm glad you have some... I'm glad you... Oh, boy. A hickety hickety hiccup. I'm glad you have some, like, faith in me. Faith in me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> Sorry about that. It was a few hiccups there you know my, my my system isn't as perfect as i'd like it to be but it's good to know that the narrator uh has um some faith in me in regards to lifting cars lifting cars okay all right i found it all right all right that's repaired start the generator okay okay good 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 Okay. Aha, there it is. Uh, so turn it on. And then garage. Right? Uh, okay, yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. What am I doing? I just realized that it said power line? No. Generator. Okay. Because there's, there's no uh, simple way, there's no obvious way that it tells you that, um, yeah, there we go. We have power again. Wish I could turn on the radio. Here we go. Excellent. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Can I pick it up now? At long last, the crowbar was within Carl's grasp. Surely it would come in handy at some point. I certainly hope so. Because, you know, you don't just hide a, a crowbar underneath something and not expect it to be useful at some point. Or at least I don't think so. Okay. Time to get the show on the road. Alright, let's see. Turn off the garage. The note explained that the garage I and know. the store couldn't be supplied with electricity at the same time. There we go. All right. Close the door because I'm afraid to cat. Uh, uh, who's to say that, uh... Oh, no. Turn that on. So who's to say that no one snuck in while I was gone? Okay, so which pump? I guess pump number two is the only one that works. There we go. Pump number one is not... Oh, wait. Nope, can't. <laughs> Good to know that uh, the music is still cheerful. Alright. 
Oh, no, nope, it's this one. There we go. Fill her up because I don't think that would be. That was quick. Carl knew straight away where to find the infuriated Gilles Lachance. Any good investigation would have to start there. But do I? <laughs> Let's look at the map inside the general store with a working heater, shall we? Yeah, see, um, now that the power's on, it's working now. Okay, alright. <laughs> hey, we solved our first puzzle. That's good. I just wish it was under better circumstances. Alright, Gelishai. Gelishai? Okay. At least, hey, that's good enough that they label everything. Hamilton's house is up there. I don't think I have to worry about that. Immediately. Where's the guy? Okay, um, I think I'm gonna have to look under my notes again. Journal. Uh, oh, Hamilton's murder. Or maybe I should look under people. Ding, 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 Oh, it just restarted. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, let's see, we did an uh, investigative hypothesis. I can easily trace back the chain of events. Hamilton wants to send a very confidential, uh, conviction? Denunciation letter to the Secret Service in Ottawa. He's planning on sending the letter inside of a locked box to send the key separately. It's cumbersome, but he's doing what he can. But something throws him off while he's in a hurry. He locks everything and mails the key, but the box somehow ends up in his serial in his killer's hands. The guy who was running away from me. When you find death threats and the person threatened is found dead, one could say the case solves itself. Only a shame the note isn't signed. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Secret service address. Okay. That's great, but I'm supposed to find a Mr. Legal? Aha! Oops, oops, oops. Gilles Lachance went to the doctors. Now I need to know if the doctor saw Gilles. I know how the, to lead the perfect investigation. That's great, but how do I find the doctors? How do I know? How do, how do, how do I know? How do I know? Oh, the doctors. There it is. Okay, so I need to head that away from the general store take the first path that leads to the left okay all right that's where i need to go oh look at me figuring things out i got a log just in case let's uh let's get going shall we man this is turning out to be a quite a bit of a Debacle. Carl was beginning to know the store and its surroundings like the back of his hand. The seeker had saw it. That's really nice. Yeah, let's turn on the radio. Hoping it's not copyrighted music. So, the doctor is uh, located the first left here. Oh, jeez. Please don't make me lose my truck. I just got it out of a ditch. It's my main mode of transportation, too. I don't think I can do this investigation without it. Oh, doctor's office. Whoa. Oh, uh oh. It's a loading screen. Can't believe I used up a bullet in that last investigation. Oh, I guess this is where we stop. This text spooked me. Come on, there's got to be somebody alive around here. I'm gonna, maybe I'll just... That's not good. 
the fact that it lets me oh, oh. There should be a law forbidding doctors from falling sick. <laughs> Medical emergency in town. The doctor there is sick. I'll be back as soon. If he dies, I won't be returning. I'll have to replace him. Of course. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. I know this is... A, this doesn't strike me as that kind of game. But all in the same. I feel but I'll feel better if I have a weapon with me. In spite of Dr. Beaupre's goodwill, the place didn't look much like a physician's office. It could easily be mistaken for a sewing shop. Oh, that's not good. Well, he's got potatoes. Does he have any... Uh, oh, boy. Someone had lost a few liters of blood here. Carl's first thought had been a lumber accident. Is there any Someone's lady? hand cut by a saw or a hunting accident. In any case, whoever had lost all this blood couldn't have gone far. Perhaps they were already dead. Well, I gotta take a picture. I mean, oh, take a camera. Someone had lost a few liters of yes, blood no. here. Carl's first thought had been a lumber accident. Someone's hand cut by a saw or a hunting accident. In any case, whoever had lost all this blood couldn't have gone far. Perhaps they were already dead. First aid kit. Oh, he's got to keep those. Store in a cool, dry place with a constant temperature, they said. Well, I mean, it's constant to a degree. Earth doesn't look this big from here. The doctor is apparently fascinated by his surgery. Carl got the trembles as he imagined the excruciating pain that kind of scalpel could no doubt inflict. Ugh. Within these miserable walls, patients probably felt more like in a slaughterhouse than in a doctor's office. You're making me feel much better there, narrator. My nightmare. <laughs> the weight. Oh dear, there's something back here, isn't there? I have to investigate that for sure. Oh, magnet. For the one-eyed, or for other vision problems, the eye patch was the way to go. Oh, more matches. Oh, okay. okay. Am I able to turn on the radio at all? Yeah, that's not going to make it less creepy. When a locking door isn't enough. When locking a door isn't enough. Oh, he's got it boarded. Jeez. Okay. I thought you were going to be endearing, but you're not. <laughs> you're not at all. <gasps> Isabel. Isabel. Wait a minute. Hold on a minute. Isn't that the picture that I have? Uh, Inventory. No. Um, uh, Isabel. Okay. Okay. So, we're making some, uh, we're making some attachments here. Or some connections, rather. I don't know what else I could find in here. I don't want to freeze to death in this place, but I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to look around. Is that thing pertinent? Yeah, I think that's just my footprint from the snow. Oh, nothing up here. Oh. Doctors used light reflecting frontal mirrors to look inside the patient's cavities. That was a bit unsettling. But back then, it was pretty much always the case with medicine. Documents. I never did I never did quite catch her name. The men called her Lore. She had a neck wound. There was so much blood. The bullet had done a lot of damage, probably hitting the cerebellum. It was hopeless. She had a cardiac arrest. The men had found her like this. They said, I doubt it. Uh, they said, I doubt it. But in a small town like this, it's usually best to turn a blind eye. 
I've been told to step back from sending out the death certificate. This whole thing sickens me. There's another one. No medical explanation whatsoever can explain why old Razer is still alive. As we in the trade say, the only way to cure him is to kill him. Okay, I'm looking at medical records now. Sylvie Berdard. All of her symptoms point to the same root cause. She's pregnant. She refuses it. She denies it. I'm willing to bet her husband it's not the father. I, let's just hope it's not Everett Lockhart, though. Or she would have an illegitimate child and a syphilis on... And, oh, oh, no. No, there's more. William Joseph there Hamilton. There was no doubt that the doctor and Hamilton knew each other very well. Haughty. Can't be cured. Chronic foot pain. Can't walk long distances. Rich. I'll cure him of that one day. I guess that's it. The good doctor. Flanked by his beautiful spouse. Pure happiness. Captured on cardstock. Carl recognized this woman's soulful eyes. Was it Dr. Beaupre who had hit him head on at the village border? I don't know. But this place was locked before I got in here. And there's a journal. I'm pretty sure that's going to be telling. And then I'm going to investigate some of this stuff that's over here. Okay, but I'm going to leave this over here. I'm going to leave this right here. Um, there's quite a bit to... Uh, try to figure out um only a little bit cold in here even though i'm pretty sure there's no heat source you know um pretty sure being in this cabin is preventing a lot of the cold from taking me down but uh we'll check that out that yeah, we'll check that out more in the next video remember if you want to know when the next one comes out subscribe to my youtube over at jim nickabacher and as always nothing ventured nothing gained